A big hello from all the staff and animals at Calder Glen Zoo. We hope everyone is staying safe and that you're all okay. In the next few weeks, we're going to introduce you to some of the residents at the zoo, so you can get to know them a little better from home and learn some interesting facts about them. We will also have a wee bit of fun and let you hear how some of them are feeling about lockdown. We hope you enjoy learning about the animals and we really look forward to seeing you all later in the year when you can come and visit them and us here at Calder Glen Zoo. Take care. Bye for now. Well, we have a wee movie night tonight. What one will we watch? Finding Dory. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. <laughs> Yes, man, we went viral. Did my nose look flexible enough in that video? Did you see me? I looked so glorious and I looked so handsome. I am beautiful. I am Kowati. That's not even your accent, Chanel. Get over yourself. My mum's injured herself doing Joe Wicks, so she's a bit laid up at the moment. Kylie. Oh, sorry. Kylie, where's my cup of tea? Come in. Meerkats can be found in savannah and open plains of Africa. In the wild, meerkats live in close-knit colonies of 20 to 40, who share a large system of burrows in which they sleep at night and raise their young, safe from predators. When emerging from their burrows in the morning, but after sunrise because they like a long lie, each adult will take a turn at guard duty. He or she will act as a sentinel and find a mound of earth or boulder to stand tall on and watch for any potential danger. This allows the rest of the group to forage in peace or groom and play. If the sentry gives an alarm call, everyone can disappear underground to safety in a matter of seconds. Meerkats are very territorial and will often get into fights with rival gangs. Usually only the alpha female is allowed to give birth in the group, but she also must continue to lead foraging expeditions at the same time. So the other females will take up the roles of helpful babysitters and look after the young when she isn't able to. Hawks and eagles are a meerkat's main predator, so it is always a good strategy to have their eyes on the sky. A meerkat has strong feet and claws suited to its burrowing lifestyle and can shift its own weight in sand in a few seconds. They can also close their small ears when digging to keep out flying sand. Meerkats have good eyesight to spot predators, but it is poor at night time, just like ours. They have a powerful sense of smell, though, to sniff out potential food sources. The dark patches around a meerkat's eyes act like sunglasses. How cool! And help shield the glare from the sun when on the lookout for predators. They have a lifespan of between 12 and 14 years. Meerkats forage in the sand for beetle larvae, termites, crickets, spiders, scorpions and other invertebrates. They will sometimes eat small snakes, lizards, eggs, birds and mice too. Meerkats are classified as least concern on the IUCN red list, but unfortunately their populations are declining due to habitat destruction and the pet trade. It's weird, you know. She was here a wee minute ago and then I said I needed help with my homeschooling and all of a sudden I can't find her. I heard her yelling they've changed maths. Mum! 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 Now remember, wash your hands before you eat and sing happy birthday while you wash your hands. I'm I'm just I'm just doing it, Mum! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! You look like a monkey! Nom 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 nom! Oh, aye, aye, I am totally keeping myself busy. I had a long distance call to my old flock mate in Australia. <laughs> well, that bill wasn't cheap. I'll get him on Twitter next time, eh? Well, ah, anyway, I need to head. We've got a movie night tonight. We're going to watch all three Lord of the Wings films. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. Tune in next week. See you then. Bye.